Praise the Lord. Today's manna is from the book of Genesis chapter 8 verses 20 and 21. Then Noah built an altar to the Lord and taking some of all the clean animals and clean birds, he sacrificed burnt offerings on it. The Lord smelled the pleasing aroma. Amen. Now, after God saves Noah's family along with pairs of all creatures, Noah chooses some of all the clean animals and birds for sacrifice. These animals and birds were escaped from the flood and protected in the ark of one year and ten days along with Noah's family. But soon after God opens the ark, these animals and birds were picked to sacrifice for the Lord. In other words, they were killed. What is the difference between life of these animals' birds with that of creatures which died during the flood? One died due to flood. Other died as a sacrifice. Isn't it at the end both were died? What's special about these animals and birds which were died as a sacrifice? These animals and birds which were protected in the ark had a noble purpose in their life. Their burnt bodies were smelled by God as a pleasing aroma. Because of that, God decides never again to destroy the living creatures and also very first time God makes covenant with mankind and set rainbow in the clouds. Everything that has breath has to die on this earth. But are we going to die like people, animals and creatures that were wiped from the earth due to wrath of God? Or are we going to die as a pleasing aroma to God by fulfilling His purpose and will in our life like these clean animals and birds? Lord, let your noble purpose be fulfilled in our life. You are protecting us every day to accomplish your will to happen in our life. Surely you will smell us as a pleasing aroma and with that you will save the mankind from hands of devil, O Lord. Use us, O Lord, for your glory. We want to live and die for you alone. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless you. Have a great day.